Okay, we're taking a look at clearing the Taffington Both House here with McCready. I hear something. Shoot a bunch of bugs. Ooh. Not a happy moment here. It's a tradition. Let's see, what was her note? Roll on down to Margaret's note. There it is. Okay. Well, I think we know what happened to Margie, and the edge of the canal. Let's go Aqua Boy mode. Aqua Boy, Aqua Boy. Anything? Okay, we're going in. Oh, okay, you walk in, it's like a door, but not a door. Okay. That's kind of freaky. It tells me unpleasant things are down here. You wanted to get the stuff. First, we're going to get soaked, then, we're going to get cold. If you weren't miserable enough already. Belief. Unable to mutter. Okay, now it's. Trophy! Pretty! Open the door. Opening doors. Ew. That smells absolutely terrible. He's got a good sense of smell. A lot of ammo. A couple of guns. Guns ahoy. Now we're just starting to have fun. I will say this uh, explosive combat shotgun, rather nice. I think the two shot laser, when you focus the laser, and when you're doing a scoped attack, probably doing more damage, but. Light bugs. Oh, that ain't good. So where are uh, where are the Suttons? Okay. There's a bunch of blood here. I just feel like it's a jump on the thing and walk across sort of deal. Okay. 
Russell Sutton. Pledge initiation instructions. Pledge initiation instructions. What is he being initiated into? Greetings, brothers! You are here because it is that time of year when we induct our newest members into this most esteemed fraternity. Before their initiation is complete, they must be prepared to receive the mysteries of our order. You can find the substances necessary to open their minds in the drainage. <laughs> you all remember from your own initiation. Remember that the pledges should be blindfolded before you bring them up the canal. And keep an eye out for anyone out in the park. The elders will be by Sunday evening for dinner, and all new pledges must be present so sick of <laughs> the normal dosage. Ah, so that's the pre-war tape he found. Why are there so many mines here? So... That's where what's his name is. Where'd the daughter end up? Maybe she didn't make it that far. Might have walked right over in the dark. I don't wanna drink you. Always resort to the internet, see if she's around or one would assume that, you know, the bugs got them all. I think we can assume that. There is not like a lot of happy stories out here, you know. It's but you don't see her. Let's see, am I missing something for lack of a flashlight? It's blocked, but it's not. Anything around the top of the, uh... I wonder if this is in the buildable area. No, it's not. Hmm. Be nice if this was all in the buildable. I mean, that would be awesome. And I don't see the... the fiancé. Okay, well, we'll just work our way this way. Bug. Bugs up. I like how in this era everybody walked around with ammo boxes full of bullets. It's very convenient. Go down around this way. Nothing here, really. Okay, let's talk buildable area. No, we can't go that that way. The fence is kind of nice. Okay, out here we're in kind of good shape. 
Let me do a little bit of building. That's really disgusting, and hopefully that gets cleaned up at some point. Hmm. You know what we need? We need a supply line. Put a new door up. This is all gift stuff. Hmm. Yeah, we definitely need to head back someplace, though. Ah, there was a contest. Yeah, let's see. Where is the nearest? Let's go to map. Show supply lines. Green Top Nursery. Yeah, Green Top Nursery. Hmm. I still have a couple things to add. <laughs> but I definitely, uh, I'm getting a little bit better hang of this with the, uh, the building tools they've added to the Wasteland Workshop. Do 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 do. We got some storage here, a whole bunch of lighting. Honor of the problems of this place here, which is blood bugs. That's kind of gross. This dead Brahmin gets kind of got stuck in the wall. You can see it's all bit up by blood bugs. I'm hoping that goes away. It does take away from the overall. This is some extra room. I'm not sure what I'm going to put up here. I'm going to put an office up here for myself. Or what. We got, you know, a living roof going on here. Lots of missiles. I, I tend to use the missiles um, when I end up with a, a settlement that just has regular settlers that can't get killed. Which is different than, say, you know, the slog where you've got some settlers that are a bit fragile. Hopefully they'll be able to get around up here. We're trying to catch a cat. Should really put a bridge across there. Like, just go down and go back up. We got... Oh, these aren't wired, huh? We can still wire stuff, even though nothing can still be built. That's an interesting oversight. So, the defense is up to 752. I think that should be adequate, considering there's, like, one person here. we got 160 water. Not an excessive amount, but they shouldn't require anything from the rest of the system. And, um... Food is at 6, but there's a lot more food than that. And we have some more room for food, if we really want to. A couple, uh... Chimacallit. We'll get some robots up here, too, at some point. Matter of fact, maybe I'll, maybe I'll do the, uh, the drop the weapons trick one more time and then put in some workshops just so I can do a couple things while I'm here. Let me put a couple in here. And in case if you're wondering how that works, what you do is you just drop some weapons. Especially the ones with the longer names are best. Eh, the mine doesn't really matter, but that explosive, advanced shotgun and all that, great. Then you go to the workshop. Now, watch the size. The little yellow thing up in the right corner there. As I store each of these in the workshop... And we're back to green. Isn't that nice? Well, I'm too low on aluminum to get a robot workbench going, but I did get uh, the standard triple arrangement of artillery pieces. We got a drum and trowel. Some more. Threw a bunch more carrots around. 
Got one scavenging station up. We're, we're pretty well rolling here. This is the Black Knight. Have Oh, you know what? Before we go, this is the Black Knight. Have a good night. Let's do this. Let's report in to Preston Garvey. Because one, one of the things about McCready is, he's, for some reason, though he's a selfish guy, supposedly, and all this, he likes it when you help the Minutemen, which I think shows a softer heart than perhaps what he has shown before. We'll see how his story goes. Definitely going to put in a robot workbench up there and get some robots working on that site as well. This unit is ready to serve. 